everybody, how's it going? Welcome to my video. I'm Sam Krakowski, and we are going to be taking a look at how garlic can be used as an adhesive to bond pieces of glass back together. So throughout history, garlic has held extreme importance in the medicinal and culinary worlds. A little fun fact about garlic is that it was deeply connected with the history of vampire stories, which we learned about during presentations. And also 80% of all garlic in today's world is produced in China. And it is known for its extremely strong odor, which is why I now have to clean my room really thoroughly. What most people don't know about garlic though, is that the juice produced from the clove is actually so sticky that it can be used as an adhesive. To begin the demonstration, we are going to use what is referred to as the head or the knob of the garlic. The next step in the process is separating the individual cloves of garlic and placing them into a container. Once finished with this step, you're left with the skin, which is disposed of, and the cloves, which we will be using. So next, a quick step, the glass needs to be broken. So the clove of the garlic is broken or cut at this point and then crushed to supply the garlic juice and really extract it. Which is extremely sticky as you can see. Okay, so the next step in the process is extremely important as we rub the crushed clove on one edge of a piece of glass, applying the adhesive juice thoroughly. And now, equally as important, we fit the two pieces of glass together and hold for a few moments. And as you can see, the garlic juice works as a bonding agent, reconnecting the two pieces of glass back together. The science behind this bond is a sulfur compound called mercaptan, which is released when the garlic is crushed or cut. This almost glue-like garlic juice can be used in many ways in everyday life. The most prominent examples are that it can be used to seal or repair cracks in glass in car windows and also in windows in your house, which helps to prevent any air from fluctuating in or out or from the cracks spreading and causing a larger damage. Thank you so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed my demonstration. Have a great day.